Here's the former Auburn kicker Daniel Carlson to get this one started. And we are underway from Santa Clara. And this is going to be returned from the middle of the end zone. And he'll be stopped right around where he would have been had he gone down to a knee, maybe a yard shy of there at the 24. Play fake. Lance. The first catch of the game for George Kittle. And he's going to be out up around the 45-yard line. The end result, 21 yards. Let's go. First carry for Christian McCaffrey. And he gets forward up the middle, but only for a couple. It'll be second down. Brandon, we talk all the time about those hybrid players, guys who could do more than one thing. And I think if you're playing strong safety in the NFL today, you are a true hybrid. Part linebacker, part cover guy. And coming up, sticking his nose in the mess there and making a nice play defensively. And he is tackled inside the 40, not quite to the 35. Lance now on first down. He rifles one that's intercepted. Picked off by Deron Harmon. The 40, 20, 10. And he takes this one back into the end zone, and the Raider defense delivers a score. Well, they were advancing the ball. They had a couple first downs under their belt, but a big mistake there on the opening drive leads to six points the other direction. And what a good read that was on his part, Brandon, because it prevents a possible scoring drive with how they were moving things along. And it gives the defense the early advantage of what's going to be a definitely entertaining battle between these units. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six. And now the kick is away. This will be brought out from the middle of the end zone. And ultimately cannot get this out to the 25-yard line as he's dropped at the 23. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. Lance going back to the air after the pick six. And that'll be incomplete. That was an interesting look there because as soon as he got outside the pocket, I thought he was going to take off and run for yardage. But what often happens now with these quarterbacks who can move, Defenses want to try and keep bodies in front of him, and I think that discouraged him from taking off and made him try a pass downfield that fell incomplete. And Lance will try again on second down. Being chased out left. And they nearly get this all the way to midfield. Break him down at the 49. Throwing on first down is Lance. Throw left side, McCaffrey's got it. And he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. Back-to-back -back nice gains. That one for 14 yards and another first. Nice little nifty play for him there. Yeah, that's the ability to read a defense and utilize players that don't often get picked up in coverage easily. And I'm talking about being able to use the backs out of the backfield. Because I know that when I used to cover, Hey, we got my cut. Oh, he just snuck out there, and they just got a nice first down there. What do we love to say? Get those backs into space, right? And they were able to do that there. Nice pickup on first down. Looking to throw again on second down. Lance. The same target, same result. It's Kittle. And he'll be hauled down at about the 30-yard line. Lance looking to throw on third and two. And the throw there going to be incomplete. You absolutely have to have this early on, right? Third and short, they elect to throw for it. And that's normal NFL football. They're going to throw on third and short, but you've got to hit it, don't you? Yeah, in the first quarter, like you said, to set the tone, can't connect there. Lance and company going on fourth down. 
And he's going to have his running back. It's complete. And they're going to be set up now with a ball at the 13-yard line. So this drive going to continue following the conversion on fourth. Here's first and 10. Inside the red zone here. They'll look to throw. Dance into his left. And he can't get rid of it. He's taken down. Chandler Jones charges in there hard and drops him for a loss of 12 from that outside linebacker position. That huge loss on the sack makes this job much more difficult. It's now second down and 22 yards to go. This is caught, and they will eventually get him down, but he's inside the five all the way to the three. A well-executed 22-yard gain. Ready? They'll try to run with McCaffrey. And he'll take this in the end zone for a San Francisco touchdown. Christian McCaffrey, a three-yard touchdown run. And the Niners are an extra point away from drawing level. Gold with the extra point, and we are tied at seven. So all even at seven now as they kick it away. Amir Abdullah going to take it out of the end zone. And he will be brought down here inside the 20. Good coverage as he's dropped at the 17. Trying to get one more in here before the quarter breaks. They'll begin on the ground with Jacobs. And he can only manage to get a couple. Second and eight coming up. 7-7, seven, seven, our score after one. The last run good for two. Here's second and eight. They'll stay on the ground with Jacobs. And he almost gets this to the 30, taken down about a yard shy. A pickup of 10, and it's enough for a Las Vegas first down. We use the word relentless a lot with guys who are aggressive on the field. In this case, it really fits, doesn't it? How about his ability to break tackles and his feet never stop moving? Carr completes it. And he takes this one down almost all the way to the 30. 39 yards there, a big one. Well, partner, I'm not sure how this drive's going to end, but how about the way they flip field position there? A nice attacking play that picked up a heck of a chunk of yardage. Now a first carry for Brandon Boulder. And this time they were waiting for him as he'll be knocked down before he can get back to the line of scrimmage. Two yards the loss, second and 12. The well, coaches stress their defense being physical. They don't just mean the big guys. How about the guys on the outside, the cornerbacks? It's not just their job to patrol the airspace. They can get involved in the run game as well. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. Third down, now even tougher. Third and 13 after that loss of a yard. And we often talk about defensive end setting the edge, sometimes even the outside linebackers. But how about here? This is a cornerback essentially setting the edge and finishing off that play for a loss. Throwing there, but this pass is going to wind up incomplete. From a defensive perspective, they had exactly what you want anytime they want to throw the football. There was pressure on the quarterback. They were getting after him, and they tightened down on the receivers and forced the incompletion. Carr going to go on fourth down. And it's incomplete. They cannot convert, and they turn it over. The Raiders try it on fourth down, but to no avail. And the 49ers are going to get the football back. So the defense has to stay out and get one more stop. They were able to do it, forcing the incompletion. So on their record, that goes down as a successful play. It doesn't matter how they got there, how it happened. They got it done. They're the ones that are jubilant. Takes it to about the 37. Not a lot of running room there, not a place to make a cut and kind of exit out because they had everything bottled up. Looked to me like the linemen were taking on their blocks really well and giving up no creases. 
Flushed out right. And he's going to be out of bounds right at midfield. Excellent work there by Lance as he scrambles for the first down. Partner, there's a downside to everything, and the danger of man coverage is if you're locking down your target, you often turn your back to the quarterback, and you don't see him. Sometimes you open up a big lane for him to hit you for big yardage, and that was an astute play by him to scramble out, see that lane, and burn them for a first down. Lance with a tap forward on the jet sweep. There he goes, left side. Touchdown, 49ers. Debo Samuel, 50 yards. And the 49ers have taken the lead. Now goal for the extra point. And he's got it. It's now a 14-7 ball game. Here is Wisnowski to boot it away following the touchdown. This taken in at the goal line. And able to get this out to the 25. set to get this drive started. They've got some stuff to build on from that last drive because they moved the football CD and then they tried to go for it on fourth down, didn't convert, probably left a bitter taste in their mouths. I would say so, and I think that they go out in this series determined for that not to happen again. In fact, they don't even want to get to a fourth down opportunity. They just want to make sure they get it done within the parameters that they've set for themselves. Run their offense, get it into the end zone. Yeah, I think a little bit of determination and a dash of anger. And now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. I think you put just a little bit too much heat on that one. When you throw it to the outside, you do have to be careful because you got to keep it away from the defender. But you also have to give your own guy a chance, too. On the draw, Boulder. And he'll take this one across the 45 up to about the 46-yard line. They do get a couple, but they'll be left staring at a third and eight coming up. Pretty good little two-play sequence there. You force the incompletion, then a very short pickup. Yeah, now maybe you bring in an extra defensive back or two because you want to try and defend on third down. They like to play those nickel or set packages. Rush coming, and he's taken down. The Raiders going to use one of their timeouts as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds to go in the first half. These strong safeties, some people may not realize it, it's really like an extra linebacker, right? It really is because they're hybrids. Half linebacker, half defensive back. The linebacker in him on that play emerged. It's Carr looking deep for Adams. And he knocks the ball away, and it falls incomplete. Boy, a real head scratcher there. And the Niners take over in terrific field position. Okay, ready? Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. Throwing now is Lance. And he'll dump this off to his running back, McCaffrey. And he is out of bounds inside the 30. Just about every quarterback is trained to really look downfield first before you come back and make a nice, safe throw. And in this case, that's exactly what he did. Found his running back, let him create some space, and it turned out to be a nice play for the offense. On second and inches, Lance eluding the pressure right. And he's going to take it in. Touchdown, San Francisco. Trey Lance, 28 yards. And the 49ers will extend their lead in the final.